To start off this look, I'm going to go ahead and start by applying concealer on my eyelids. And I always apply the same concealer, which is Maybelline Instant Age Wearing Concealer. Alright, so now that I'm done with that, I'm going to go ahead and set my concealer using the RCA Main Translucent Powder. And I'm just going to be applying it on top of the concealer. Alright, so to start off with this look, I'm going to go ahead and use the NYX Ultimate Shadow Palette. And I'm going to go ahead and use this yellow shade right here and just apply it on my crease, but just in the inner part. So like right here, just kind of ending right here. So like as you guys can see over on this eye. Purple shade, both of these shades together and just applying it in the middle of my crease. Alright, so now that we're done with that, I'm going to go ahead and use this pink shade right here. And I'm going to be applying this shade on the outer corner, so like all the way here. Alright, so now that I'm done applying the eyeshadows, I'm going to go ahead and do a cut crease, like you guys see over on this eye. And to shape it out, I'm going to go ahead and use the same concealer that I've been using, which is the Maybelline Instant Angel Wine Concealer. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and apply the NYX Glitter Primer below the yellow and just work my way through. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and outline above the cut crease, so like over what I did over on this eye. And so I'm going to use five different eyeliners and four of them are from NYX Vivid Brights and it's just like a yellow pink shade, a purple shade and a white shade. And then the other one is from Maybelline and it's just like a black eyeliner. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and use a purple eyeliner right above the glitter and just end where the purple starts. And then where the purple starts, I'm going to go ahead and use pink eyeliner and then end where the pink starts. And then where the pink starts, I'm going to go ahead and use the yellow eyeliner. And then when I'm all done with that, I'm going to go ahead and use this yellow eyeliner so just be very careful once you're applying it and you don't want to apply a lot of eyeliner because it will crack on you and it will kind of like start peeling off so you want to be careful with that and not apply a whole lot of it Alright, so now that I'm already done with that, I'm going to go ahead and start um, doing like little designs and stuff like that. And the first thing I'll do is it's going to be a little egg. This little egg that you guys see over here, and I'm going to do it over here, and I'm going to do the same exact thing. So to shape it out, I'm going to go ahead and use this white eyeliner. And then I'm going to make like little zigzags, and then for that I'll be using this shade. And then for this little egg, I'm going to go ahead and do stripes, and the stripes are going to be yellow. Alright, so now the next thing I'll do is going to be a bunny, and I'll just do like the face and like the ears. So, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and start first with the ears, and then I'm going to kind of make a little half little circle for the face. and I'm gonna go ahead and use this black eyeliner and then I'm gonna do a little nose and it's gonna be gonna be this pink eyeliner and they're just gonna be like little dots 
All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and do another little egg. And this one's gonna be zigzags. go ahead and just do dots all around using these four shades all right so i'm already done with my eyes and lashes i applied were the k face beauty lashes in high maintenance and then for our face i'm gonna go ahead and start with primer and this is the dopes and glory one heck of a blot And then I'll be using the NYX Full Coverage Foundation. So I already went ahead and set my makeup with the RCMA Translucent Powder, Fame Up and Up Flat Powder Foundation in Chestnut. Alright, so now that I'm done with that, I'm going to go ahead and bake my face with the same RCMA translucent powder. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and apply some blush and I'm going to go ahead and apply the Milani Romantic Rose Blush. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and apply some highlight I'm going to go ahead and use the ABH Amrazy Highlighter. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and apply yellow underneath where I applied the yellow and then same with the purple and pink. And then I'll apply the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara. 